Hello everyone! Hello, 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 hi, 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 it's time again, it is time again. For more! Don't look at that up there, wait for mission. Hi everyone! It's game time! Oh, I didn't finish my cereal, whoops, bad boy. Aww. I have to take a bite. Take a bite every turn. Mm. Hi everyone. Straight into it today, we should be. We already did the gear up yesterday for a bomb disposal in Mexico. We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. Put your shop bomb disposable. Slayer uh, going on their second mission ever, an assault with close encounters in the zone. Deadeye and reasonable aim. Stormy Jab, Suppression, Lock and Load, Shredder, Hollow Targeting, Hit and Run of a GMG, we'd rather an auto rifle, but we don't have one right now. Titan Armor is here, that's right. Camelot with Run and Gun, Lightning Reflexes, Collateral Damage, VPT. Aim could be better, but here she is. Yeah, as Camelot subscribes in chat for 87 months, the shining star of XCOM, Camelot. Thank you so much, Camelot. Lone Outlaw with the Grenadier. Iron Skin, Collateral Damage, Lightning Reflexes, and Resilience. A lot of clap in this squad. Lots of clap in this squad indeed. Oracle of Maya with an incredibly high amount of health. And all this other stuff. Clap Iron Skin. Reinforced Armor. Resilience, our main tank. Obsidian, who is still trying to find death like a troll slayer, berserker, little dwarf slayers. Got the rockets, got line them up and good aim. Ball, who avoided dying on the base defense by not being rolled for it. Heat ammo alloy strike rifle, rapid reaction, platform stab, shredder ammo revive and paramedic. Finally, Dalmatian Dash, the Clown Prime. Some double tap for later, but mostly dense smoke, backmaster, battle scanner, field medic, some med kits, and a bunch of smokes. And Team Cat One with the Sentry Gun, Motion Tracker, Heat Ammo, and Small Shell Pod. The game's ready. Go. Strike one. Prepare for landing. We're going to be putting down in Mexico for this mission. Okay. Um, where is the... One sec. Baby! Fifteen. Okay. La Kishen Open, 15 Dubai. Welcome everyone, make sure to use the up-to-date menu and let's see if I can not fuck this mission up. Yeah, it's still mute on move, Mom, that's right, just check the menu, but yep, still is. At least there's a lot of these around. New objective received. Anyone else gonna grab that? Almost certainly. So better off with the shiv to immediately get cracking. Why didn't reference anything? He just does that sometimes. That's just a thing reference sometimes does. Beep beep. So probably got him there and there. I'm not sure if we have aliens inside the freezer here. Nix, is that you? No, Luna. Luna! Come here! Yeah. Come up here. Meow, meow. You good? Good baby. Luna wants to go in to see Jam in bed. 
I think position wise they might just be in the freezer but I'm not certain if not they might enter it I think these ones probably are let's see no they're outside okay but you've got some ones outside right there so what would be good is to grab these three nodes get some people in a position here get rid of the clat a bunch of shit up okay get ready for clat Movie limited. Who needs to get a position right now? Obsidian, Camelef, Stormy, and Ball. Okay, so Ball can probably come to here and watch the side in case they go to the right. They're already kind of close to the corner, so yeah, Ball come to here. On the move. Shouldn't activate, but it could. Okay, cool. <laughs> Got that. We'll overwatch there. Power node, power down. Exactly. What's up, Slayer? Let's defuse the bomb. Yeah, let's do that. Let's defuse the bomb. I think that's a good idea. You can come here, I think, Stormy. That's a bit move limited, actually. Someone else would be good. You'd be better to put Stormy here. Hey, what's up, Neeman? Camelif. It's gonna come over here. And where's Obsidian going? Okay, so Obsidian has to go there, actually, which means the gunner should go there. Gunner goes here. So this is me and Ball are fighting for the Olympic gold and alien kills. Sure. Sure you are. That's what's bad for me, Noah. I mean, what do you want? Here? Like, where do you want to go? Want the fence block my rocket? No, it shouldn't. I don't think it should. Doesn't really matter either way because we're aiming down here. Oh, there's nowhere better for you to go. Hello, Stoops. One floater, please. Yeah, you got it. Thanks, Stoops. There you go. One floater ordered. When I start this early with no hour of loadout, New no one's buying. Zero zero donation from Stoops. Why do they call it outsider when you out in the side <laughs> shoot off out shoot meld the gun? <laughs> Floated, there you go. Yeah, I didn't realize this is the secret. If you do the loadout in the previous stream and then start the next mission immediately, nobody's here yet. Luna. Luna. What the? Are they like beating up the walls? What the? Luna! Come here! I don't know what's going on. I, what is going on with my cat? Sorted. <laughs> Luna really wanted to go in. Oh, my chair. I really need to get some oil in this chair, hey? Kamalef, you are fast. I like to see how fast you are, but don't go there. Go here, yeah. Understood. Moving out. Is this an old chair? No, it's it's another chair. That, that This chair is now old too, you know? That's how the ravages of time work. Yeah, you'd have to go to the right, which is not a good idea. Better to go to here with you, I think. Ten four. The chair. I gotta lube that chair up. I do. I do. I gotta lube that chair up. I'm on it, Commander. Do you still have the chair of the hole? Yep, it's in the back corner. It's around. Just walk on over that meat. That's affirmative. Neiman says EW could definitely use the waypoint system from X2. Yeah, one of the many reasons I'm looking forward to playing X2 again. It'll be nice to get all that new stuff again. Oh, 
Beach. And one floater coming in at the LZ. Well, opposite the LZ. Alright. Zoom, 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 zoom. Toggle foul. Drop floater. Back we go, easy, easy first turn. It really is the speedrun strat. Might get this bomb mission done. Disarm. Lights out on that power node. Okay, I'm pretty sure these are gonna be fine to open. Yeah. They are gonna be just through this door, I think. I can probably tile scan them. Are they? They're they're straight along your path. Are they flying? You think you'd see them? Oh, there they are. There they are, right there. I think. Okay, yeah. So you got gamers spotted right there. Well, considering time is of the essence, we may as well just push up to the doors and get as many people up as possible, and then just gap through them. I guess. So you got some there, and you have some on the left as well. There's really nothing else to do about it. We just gotta get forward and get them done. There's ones on the left. They fell back as well, so they're both along here. Yeah, I mean, just get up there and get ready to go, I guess. How far in can you get? Not really far enough. But I don't want to, like, fuck around and sit here for ages either. Uh, maybe I should get that node. That gives me more time. Then it puts you all out of position for too long. Ooh, I want to get there. Is there any way I can, like, shave some extra tile off? No. Oh, not a classic obsidian rocket? Yeah, we might. Let's bring the ship up here. You can see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. They're all in there. Seems too far up to get a good rocket ready here, unfortunately. Alert. No color perk icons. Oh, I couldn't do that in time. Hey! Two outsiders ordered themselves. Thank you. You got it. Thank you very much. That'd be kind of scary on that rift, actually. I don't know how to do it. 24.00 donation from two outsiders. Very generous, thank you. Two outsiders. Two outsiders said two outsiders. Very generous, thank you very much. Appreciate that order, thank you. Yeah, I tried to look into how to do that that colored icon thing, and it looked a little bit more complicated to, to do than maybe my skill set will allow, I think. I'm not sure I can pull it off. Slam him up. Move. Domination dash. Could also come up, I guess. Where is Obsidian going? Show me where Obsidian's gonna end up. There. Stormy ending up. It would be good to get someone on that bit there. Put Stormy here for right now. Sac sur sac. Ball needs to come in as well. Probably put Ball here to grab that for me. Ooh, don't go that way though. You come this way. Yeah, you come here. You'll grab that for me next turn. I think we're leaving these nodes for now. We can always run back and get them later if we need them. But for right now, I think we're gonna ditch them there. Uh, you, Dalmatian Dash. I wouldn't mind getting this scanner over, but it would be kind of hard to pull off here without you not being in place for next turn. But it would be, it would have been smart to scan outside. I could run to the right and chuck one over the top and then you're kind of out of position. Not too out of position though, you can still get a, a smoke off.
It is possible if you go to the left, though, that you're still going to activate something. They're pretty far away, though. You shouldn't. It shouldn't happen. Maybe I'll do that. Headed there now. Oh, there's a node here, too. It's kind of good to know. Kind of good to node. Okay. Relax. There's something out there. I can't get the scan off. I can put one there, though. That's not bad. Let's scan here and see what's going on. We've got eyes on the AO. Mouton. Muton, Muton, Seeker. Floater, Floater, Muton. Yeah, and then you've got Muton, Muton, Seeker. And who knows what else. None of that is too frightening, so I'd say just get ready to like go in next turn. While Obsidian like does their best to catch up. When you pop out, you're probably going to activate... Well, if you go left, you're going to activate all three, so you want to try not flanking left. So you come to here, Maya. Roger that. Uh, Is that the bomb? Oh yeah, we see the bomb too, which is also really good. Remember the bomb being bigger? No, it's always been that size. Oh. I didn't need to go there either because you could grab it this turn, silly me. Well done. Node is deactivated. Brain very small. Come, come. Steady. Could you up front? Position confirmed. And next turn. What? What? Huh? Haven't seen that one since vanilla. What the fuck? Well, you don't get to shoot, do you? Mm, no, I, I'm i sorry. I think we're going to go ahead and alt F4 that turn. I hope everyone understands. Uh, I don't think we're going to let that one play. <laughs> Alert. Sorry. Uh, going to gonna call that one not correct, XCOM. Play it as it lays. Yeah, I, I don't think so. I think we're going to alt F4 that turn. New Vinti Punto Zero Zero donation from Oracle Maya. Okay. To mutons and a drone, please. Yeah, you got it. You wish to capture more mutons in order to acquire more grenades. Hang on. That... It's like playing Tarkov, but with aliens. <laughs> okay, hang on. Thank you. Two mutons and a drone. Thank you very much. This makes everything weird now. Hang on. Two mutons. One drone. Thank you very much, Maya. Appreciate it. This makes it weird now, because now I don't know if the floater is spawned already. Where, where, where are we? We've gone back in time now. Uh, we, we're at the start of the second turn. So I should have to spawn the floater again. That was whack. Is that because they were battle scanned? I've never seen that happen before off a battle scanner. That was whack as fuck. So if anyone played a lot of vanilla, you'll remember this was a very common bug back in vanilla. Well, I'm gonna try to do the same moves again. Increase the kitchen count? Oh, no, I forgot on all the excitement. Thank you. Up to five. No, six. Thank you for that. What was the battle scanner bug? No, this is a brand new one I've never seen, Will, where, like, they teleported in. I don't know if it was related to the battle scanner or not. Lights out on that power node. I guess I'll try to do the same thing as again, because I'm not trying to cheat here. I'm just trying to, like, not have them cheat. So you're gonna use your scanner again. You're gonna do all this stuff again without pretending you know things. And he says, Pod teleport is never properly fixed in Long War. Yeah, just mostly fixed, right? Uh, I can't remember exactly where I went. I think Kamalov went there. Heading to that location. Should've got that pod. Um, blah, 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 blah. Uh, I think Maya was like there. Yes, sir. You came in and got the pod. That's affirmative. There. Well done. Node is deactivated.
Uh, you were here. No, you were there, because I was looking at the pod. I should have seen that I was looking at the pod, actually, if I was smart. We chucked a scanner that was like... Okay, hang on. Hold on. What's making that noise? We chucked a scanner that was like... Eh. Here? Scanner no, this is a normal amount of noise environment. I haven't changed them. What should happen again? Yeah, we'll see, I guess. It'd be weird if it happened again, but it definitely could happen again. Sí, señor. I Ali, put you there. Yeah. And I think Bull came in through here. Ah, uh, rolling. That was getting you the play going a little for on submission. No, I don't think I will, Stoops. Somehow I don't think I will. Okay, I have to play the turn differently. That's weird as fuck. So maybe it's related to the battle scanner. I should back this save up in case... Swift usually wants these because he's building Longwood Community Edition. I should back this save up and send it to him. Because it, it seems like the battle scanner is doing it. We'll see if the battle... Not doing the battle scanner doesn't do it. But I'm just going to take this save right now. I'm going to send it to Swift. In case he wants it. Because when you get these, it's good. Swift, 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 Swift. When you can repro it like this. Okay, I'm just going to send this to Swift. I'm going to say... Just got a weird turn where... If I don't activate on this turn... But I throw a battle scanner... Over the building... Behind the... The truck and see... All... Was it four of her pods? All the... Pods of mutons and seekers... And I block the door with the shiv. The close muton pod just teleports both its mutons inside the butcher shop. You can see the exact moves I made at this time on my stream VOD if you're curious. Just thought you might want this seeing as you usually are interested in these bug saves. Alright. Here we go. Time step for VOD, it's currently currently 26 minutes into my VOD. This prob started been around 20 minutes into VOD, if you're interested. Alright, so now I have to play the turn differently. I think I have to not scan. That's weird as fuck. I have to spawn the floater again too. Obsidian says, first I was cooked on base fence, now this released me. Obsidian, what is going on in your life, man? Okay. So, I think I just need to not battle scan. Um, to, to try and, or not battle scan them. I guess I'm just going to play a little bit differently. I'm still going to try to be as uncheesy as possible. Oop, flutter, flutter, flutter. So we're going to try to do, like, mostly the same thing, because I'll just try not to battle scan. And that, that'll just be how it is, you know? Good thing we started this one earlier, right? So we can get through all this tech bullshit. On the move. Solid copy. Yes, we'll now. Aye, aye, Commander. Oh. Alert. Lights out on that power node. <laughs> Is this like drone command for Mel? That's affirmative. New 2.00 donation oh. from Mel. Mel. Hello, Commander. Well done. It's me the Mel. Mel denies. Melding denies. Pulsing denies. From the city to missions over ACM, scared of bombs. Thank you for the donation. Banny says, you know you can anti their cheese by having Bolo overwatch inside. If we can't stop them from doing it, I'll just overwatch them, I guess. But they'll still get to shoot. I'm thinking that it might be what Neutra was saying as well. It might be because they want to go through the door, but I've blocked it. Maybe that's why they're doing it too. Maybe it's a combo. If it still happens without battle scanning, then we'll know something, right? We'll know. Roger that. Scanning. I got a prize. 
Well, I don't think it'll happen about the battle scanner. We'll see. What was that? It's kind of annoying because I logged up the scanner there to see what's going on this turn, but eh, it is what it is, right? Yeah, so it looks like the scanner was responsible there. Scanner has a lot of interesting bugs. Like that. Toggle foul. Keep your ult F4 fingers ready when you're playing Long War, folks. There's still some bugs. Drop Outsider. Drop Outsider. Again, they're going to be annoying up that roof. Drop Muton. Drop Muton and drop Drone. Thank you for your orders, everyone. Banny says, I think they broke a lot of scanner interaction when they made proxy mines activate. Yeah, that probably makes sense. Noah says, it's so nice for you to do QA 12 years after release on the game, Beings. Rex, I should give you a raise. Thanks, man. Yeah, it did happen again, girl. Okay, um, we're gonna go. Enemy floater, floater, muton. I would have liked to use the scan information to, like, be sure I wouldn't activate other crap this turn, but it's not gonna work out that way. I could track again, I guess. Yeah, okay. Camelot can see them both. Ideally, you only don't you don't activate any other crap here this turn, right? But you still might. Yeah, you know, that's the bomb over there. Do you ever know it is? Oh, Swift replied already. Yeah, this was it. That sounds wild. Yeah, I'm just going to tell Swift. Can confirm on stream 2. Did everything the same, but didn't battle scan, and they didn't TP scanners at it again. Yeah, Swift's doing all kinds of modern with Long War, so he usually appreciates those things. If I activate the roller door here, I'd say it's very likely I activate you through here and have a pod. I don't want to keep the ship ready. Am I going to be able to kill these guys without activating that? The shotgunner with DEITZ is right here. We can probably do this without activating our crap. If I'm very careful. Just going to know exactly where they are. So if they're like here, I can probably tile scan them too. Yeah, there they are. If we see them there, if there's a flyer that might actually be the seeker. If we see them there, the other thing we've got inside or something. So as long as you don't activate these two, you should be good. So I would move the ship to a position like here, yeah. Or there. That shh that might activate still. Wanna put the shotgun on one of these positions too. I don't think that should activate, but we'll see. Okay, we're good. No, don't go in the Banny says you can probably use extra move to kill the mutant and back off and make the floaters push. Use by the kitchen orders. Yeah, yeah. Uh, two outsiders, two mutants, and a drone. Um, I think because of the CE dead eye shotgun, I can probably just kill them all anyway. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the CE here for a freebie. And I reckon I can just kill the slayer. Position confirmed. Because he's gonna have a really good chance to hit, yeah. So now if I just do this with CE, big battle boot. And then what we want to do is use Camelef to get the others. Do I have any hollow that's relevant here this turn? It's also potential the floater could get me this turn, I guess. I should, probably should have thought of that. Uh, worst case, it is just one floater, but I probably should have thought of that. They probably won't see me. If I open the roller doors, I could see them, but I think it activates. Do I think all- Oh no, wait, you're also a GMG, so you can't do anything. Silly, silly. Okay, so yeah, not really any holo targeting here. Let's shoot you. Good shot. Well done. Now do another one. Very consistent, Camelot. Nice job. Now we should just be able to go. I mean, I can get the cover as well, if you. I just realized. I, just, I can just go. One. Two. Three. No longer a threat. 
Haven't really done in a zone of a shotgun much before, but that was pretty fun. I guess you don't get this normally, do you? I never build scouts with in the zone in normal long war, so I've never really done much shotgun in the zoning before in lo uh, long war or XCOM at all. It feels kind of good to run in close quarters and just clear everyone out like that. Deadeye is a really nice combo for Slayer here, because as expected, just melt the flyers, eat shit. Tracer Solvers. <laughs> Shouldn't he have to shoot? We just needed Kamalef to do very two very nice shots, very accurate, and then Slayer just cleans up. See, Eve has it in his own as well. Yeah, you're a real house clearer. I, you might have a future Slayer if you survive. You, at Master Sergeant, could be a very interesting soldier. Your aim's already pretty good. Are you a Major or a Tech Sergeant? I think you're only a Tech Sergeant. You've only had, like, one mission before. You could be quite a good little... clearer. Very interesting. Alright, so we have to be careful now. We're setting up for... these guys next. So, are you okay over there? Yeah, she's fine. Um, these guys next. One of the bombs. So, three, bomb, three, might be a floater there. Okay. Make sure you consider capturing the cab with the truck trailer. Yeah, I always do. Yeah, I'm quite. That's why I'm not gonna go to the left here. What I'm probably just gonna do is get some people set up on the doors here, like Rocketeer here, or GMG there, Rocketeer here. Maybe Rocketeer there, because we're going to be more important, I think. And then everybody else kind of like stacked up around the truck, and then next turn we'll take that pod. Oh, Rocketeer can't make it to there. So if we give it a rest, you're not going in the closet. I mean, it's probably getting you lot ready to go as well. I would say you come here. Mm, you actually kind of want to tank, I just realized. You come here, outlaw. Beagle. Beagle. Stoop says, is this the furthest or second furthest we made it in the campaign? By far the furthest. Our last one died in, like, September. It's November now. Not our last one, but our, our second longest one. Maya goes here so that if the Shiv does see, Maya's the one who gets shot. I mean, if the floater does see, Maya's the one who gets shot. Moving to position. Maya's the best one to tank. Thought the AQ one had firestorms? No, you... No. <laughs> Definitely not. Definitely not. We wish. We do wish, but no. Come here, Stormy. It's it. No, we, we have... I don't think we even got the Gauss last time. Maybe we just barely did, but um, this is by far the farthest we've got. Okay. Ball can come and watch here, I guess. Well, dude. Might have been a good put spot to put Obsidian, actually. I think I might put Obsidian here next. Or if you run Obsidian up to here, at least next turn, they can be on here to breach the building. So maybe that's better. I could also just move Ball. Ball probably doesn't get anything to do there at this turn. So I could just move Ball off. Got it. Got it. And then put Obsidian up here this turn. Domation. Are we too worried about the nodes here? I mean, you could hit two of them in a row. And I don't really want to scan again because of that bug. So I'd probably just have Obsidian. Oh, I mean, not Obsidian. Domation go like this and then like this. Give us plenty of time Power this mission. Down. That'll buy you some time. Covering now. Reload. Next turn. Now, that rooftop's gonna look quite scary now because there's gonna be a floater and potentially two outsiders and a drone up there. It's only the mutons have to go around the long way. We should exploit that though. Those mutons spawn in the back will have to go around the long way to the left. So we'll wanna keep that LMG set up on them. Oh man, that was quick. They dashed up. That was quick. That ball should be the one who sees them, right? Or is it Obsidian? Yeah, it's ball. Oops. Hang on, my cats are being very cat today. Hey, you can't go there. That's behind the cables. Come here. Come here, little baby. Yeah, you're like a little rock. There you go. So, 
pretty obvious what we want to do here, isn't it? A little bit of collat time. A little bit of cushmanneral damage. I have a lot of turns here. So I don't need to rush this, I can just take my time, I think. Let's just get someone you've bought yourself some time. to do the... You still need to hurry, or... Well, you know. The black clap. I think the NG. Just clap them too. I mean, should I grenade? I might need the damage. How am I gonna kill these guys once I destroy their shit? I might have to go upstairs, I think. Where are the chicken nuggets? I have no idea what you're talking about. You should shoot them properly. That's a great tip, Panzer. Thank you. Good idea. So I'm gonna have to go you to there. Can't Ball just sunshine them? No, because Ball... And funnily enough, you can't see them there. Ball is not a multi-shooter. Ball is a reactor. It might be close enough to shotgun them, but I think you'll still need the damage. That's why I think we need a grenade here instead. Because we're going to need the extra damage from the grenade, I think. I think you're going to have to come back to this roof. Because otherwise, you're not going to have enough firing positions. Alert. Shoot me to elite, 17 forward. <laughs> Battle scatter bug! What the fuck? <laughs> New 36.00 donation from Battle Scanner Bug. Due muton elite, fuck 17 you. forward. F fuck you! Two elites! 17 F! How far is that? That's uh. Like, I'm gonna have to count this properly next time, but one, two, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. I think that's gonna be a free $36, actually. But god, that's a funny joke. <laughs> Could be an easy elite cap. Yeah, if I brought repairs, yeah. Yeah, very, very good mute on elites. They're gonna spawn a here next turn. Are you sure you want them 17 forward? You don't want them like here, maybe? <laughs> the, the, the reason the battle scanner bug is scary is because they get to shoot on that turn. I, I don't think this will be too bad. Anyway, um, I think we're gonna make this work. Wouldn't it be funny if I talked all that shit and then they killed me? <laughs> now that's a donor with some chest hair, that's right! Alright, we got a full activation on the left as well. Well, not full, I think there's some more. Watch the flanks. Okay, so we've got, we've got our work cut out for us this turn now. We've got one, two, flow to there, whatever. One, two, three, four, five. Just gotta kill the mutons, really. This is why I didn't want to move the shiv yet, because I thought the shiv might end up doing this, which is exactly what they are gonna do. Now we open roof access, which means we're gonna shoot. Yeah. Who's gonna handle this shit bag? I think we're gonna need another grenade over there. Or cl mm. push mineral. You can almost flank, but not quite. Slayer. If you kill at it, Slayer can kill it, but that'll activate something else, I think. I think Kalat should let Slayer probably kill all of them. Well, not Kalat, has to be a grenade, remember? But yeah, I think we grenade here. Ooh, but if I grenade instead of collating, it's gonna open up the bottom and then I'm gonna activate everything at once. So we actually really wanna Kalat. Kalat, that gunner can kill it. Yeah, if I Kalat it properly, the gunner should be able to kill that. It'd be kind of hard though. You have to not get this. Well, no, I guess you can just get all of that. And let the gunner just... Yeah, okay. Just take out everything to the left. 
Who has the collab for that? We have three of them. I guess Maya does that one. I guess Maya does that one. I'm probably gonna run Maya inside so I can actually see what I'm doing. Okay. Come here. Okay, and we need to get all of this crap. But not the front. So not there. But all are here. But not the front of the wall. Just there. That ought to do it. Damn. That is not at all what I expected to happen there. Okay. Really wish I didn't have to bring the GMG on this mission, but... Interesting. This didn't blow up, which makes me wonder if I could even collapse that. That's worrying. That's quite worrying, actually. That's very concerning. Do I have a second set of grenades? Just the one, I think. I have a third collapse. Okay, I might have to do something very different. Look at physical item again in a second action. Yeah, I don't know if it's gonna work though. Because I feel like if it, if Kalat was gonna work on that wall, it would have just worked then. But then an alien grenade wouldn't work either, Beagle. So I guess it'll have to work. But that's a bit fucking concerning overall, honestly. Why didn't that blow up the wall? That was positioned correctly, I think. It should be destructible. Yeah, you can even see this half cover there. The, I don't know, weird. Okay, listen, go like this, I think. I've never seen a wall like this just not explode. This should work. Yeah, there you go. It was just... I don't know, maybe I just didn't place it right. Fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you. Obsidian can go bang bang. And yeah, I'm gonna have to not grenade you. Okay. So we're gonna have to go like this. Oh fuck, it still blew everything up anyway. God damn. What the hell? Okay, well this turn just got interesting. One, two, three. This turn just got very interesting. I didn't use obsidian yet, did I? No, good. Okay. This turn got very interesting. Running out of dice now. Ah, that appears to have made it worse. Yeah, just steadily this turn, things have got worse and worse and worse, it seems. But that's okay. Maybe Obsidian will save the day. As you RPG the bomb, uh, assumedly top marks and great defusals will come to you. Okay, Raketten. There. Boom. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's a really good rocket. Well done. More words of affirmation for you. Great job. Um, one, two, three, four, but the outsiders. Mm. And that's a big muton. What if. You have know, snapshot. What if I commanded a shredder in there? 
you have snapshots, it probably won't be very good. You're probably better off, like, combining a nade or something. Seven sectoids. That maxes it out, I think. Thank you. F from seven sectoids. Seven sectoids. Thanks so much. New Ventura Punto <laughs> zero, zero donation from Sette Sectoids. Sette Sectoids. <laughs> Thanks, you got it. Team Eaton Elite 17 forward and seven sectoids after this one. The <laughs> Revolver Ocelot, yeah. <laughs> Revolver Ocelot, Revolver Ocelot. The problem is, these guys are going to be really hard to take down at this rate. Ball's definitely going to want to overwatch the end of this one, I think. What's the Shiv gonna do? Get sacked? I think, um, you got Slayer. You remember I was talking about your promising career? Yeah, you've got Respirator, right? Yeah. Slayer probably comes to here, CEs, and then goes, like, as many ITZs here as possible. I have six shots. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I don't have enough. I just do not have enough. You guys are all I have left. I don't have enough shots. Scary as shit. You should be able to ITZ after run and gun, right? Yeah, there's no reason you shouldn't be able to do that. So I guess you could just like... ITZ to this spot. So at least you have some cover. But then you can't CE, that's why. Ben says, I think we need to command nade the outsiders and potentially two be done downstairs. Mm. Even a good nade on the outsiders doesn't get them low enough to be itz though, with everyone else fucked. I could see you maybe double tap you and the ship could go off and get one of them. Someone's gonna finish you off as well. I guess you're gonna finish off this gamer. Or Dash could do it. But then Dash doesn't get the smoke and I feel like smoke's gonna be important, but I don't know if I can even get smoke through there. Maybe? I don't think the gunner is really primed to do anything much better. Though, could get rid of that seeker, but I might just ignore the seeker, I think. Might be cool. And then I'll try to get Dalmatian, I guess, to here, and then try to throw smoke through there. After I run Slayer in, who is probably going to take a lot of damage. I think I'll run the Shivan of you, too. And we'll just kill as many of them as we can. Not all of them will be dead, but as long as I can kill most of them. I actually need to get rid of this Seeker, because if I don't get rid of that Seeker, they're gonna get Ball. And Ball won't have a good Overwatch. No, damage doesn't stop Overwatch, actually. It doesn't matter. Damage doesn't stop Overwatch. Okay, kill this fucker. Okay, that's your turn done. Correctly, yes. Really not favorite. No, in the, in the moment of our victory? No, 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 no. Let's see what Dash can do with grenades. With smoke grenades here. Headed there now. Um. Uh, <laughs> Okay, not ideal. Wait, 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 there was a good one there. Hang on. Magic Pixel it. There was a better one. There was one that went hard. It wasn't. I swear there was like a line that went straight through. Around here? There's still a floater on the right as well. I think that's smoke. I know it is. I know. I know what I'm doing. I'm trying to decide where my smoke is. We need to decide where the shotgun is going to go. Hmm. The magnum. Yeah, for, for if Slayer runs in, they're going to need smoke cover afterwards. They can probably get to here. CE, bang, 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 bang. Probably get a bunch of them if they can't get them. <sighs> How much damage do you need to kill those two outsiders? You would need 
a lot more than I have. I would need like two grenades, not one. I don't have two grenades. So I think the outsiders very annoyingly are going to like get to live on. Though maybe no, I won't do enough damage. I don't have mayhem. Ten. They have so much health. True. Bull does have shred. If Bull shoots one of them, Bull can only shoot one. Should have brought a Slippo instead. I guess the turn is... You ITZ and CE clear all the Mutons except one. Run into the Shiv, Shiv helps. Bull one, Shiv the other. Yeah, I guess... I guess if CE clears this one personally, then you can go one, two, three, four, five, six shots. The shotgun may miss these guys, in which case we need to grenade anyway. But then, assuming somehow Slayer kills all of the Mutons personally, then Bull could shoot one, Shiv could shoot the other, and maybe with grenade it's enough. Maybe if you crit? I'm not certain. So the order of operations is Slayer first, everyone else after. Slayer might run into like Panic to the Mutant, which would be horrendous. How much damage does the ATZ have? Six. So we have six shots. Okay. Confirm that you can even see the engineer. Yeah, good. Confirm the smoke position. Okay, so if you can get it to there. That's 753. Can we get any closer? Any closer would help a lot, because any closer. Where are you? It's not you anyway. No, you can't get any closer anyway. 753. Okay, so that's fine. You go to here and we'll get to work. And he says, Grain is better used on clumps because of ITZ damage fall off. Ooh, you're just going to be on the grenades. Better use on clumps because of ITZ damage fall off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's also a case I've been thinking of here is maybe I could just grenade the mutons. But I think I'll have enough damage to kill them all because they're all very low. Whereas I won't be able to ITZ these guys. So I think it's probably better to go this way. So let's run you up to- maybe don't sack the rookie. I'm not sacking them. I'm killing with style. Go! To position. Cool. Okay, now you want to go. Close encounters. And depending on their health. Nice, we got pretty good chances of healing these guys. I might save the command in case you fail the ATZ chain there. Worst case, you're gonna deal with those two outsiders, which will be awful, but it is what it is. But then you probably go like one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Okay. So let's have a go. Start here with CE. Please don't panic. Panic would be really bad in your position. Okay. Probably want to do that one first because of ITZ damage fall off. Very likely to kill there. Five, six, seven, eight. It, it is possible to fuck this up, but it's unlikely. Bad. Pretty good, pretty good turn there though. Pretty good turn there. Yeah, shotgun in a turn is cool as fuck, it turns out. Yeah, who knew, right? It's actually pretty fucking good. Pretty fucking good. Alright, you did pretty good there, honestly. That was pretty good. Having another mutant up though is really scary for you. But you did pretty good. Hopefully, Ball will hit that one on Overwatch. So, Ball needs to Overwatch here, I think. 
And he died. No, I don't think they'll die. I think they'll be okay. I think they're going to be okay. Shiv's going to go in as well to help. Great work, Shame about the plasma. Yeah, shame about all the plasma. Shame about all the plasma, bruh. Do I want to bait grenades or not? I don't know. Do I want to just go for that one? Do I want to just kill this Seeker? No, let the Seeker shoot. Doesn't matter. Very unlikely to panic ball off a shot. I think let the Seeker do whatever. Oh, actually, though, the worst thing the Seeker could do is move first and ruin Ball's Overwatch. So I guess actually kill the Seeker. Because otherwise that could be a problem. I guess you have to kill the Seeker for that reason. So I guess the ship doesn't go here and it's just you baiting all that. Okay, Slayer, if you go down, you have a respirator and I promise I'll use Meld to heal you, okay? If I have some left. 30 days at max, Slayer. 30 days out at maximum, okay? You'll probably live anyway. Titan's a hell of a drug. You'll be fine. You're gonna be a-okay. So we're gonna come here, kill that one. You're gonna come here, overwatch. The outsiders are the real problem. Ball themselves, I hope they're getting smoked because they're in danger. Lone Outlaw is also in danger. What do I do here? If if I'm not even gonna bother trying to grenade them to kill them, what what maybe I come on someone else. But then you're in too much danger. Maybe I still go for the grenade and then maybe I'm able to like ball overwatch kill you guys. Possibly. It could happen. Alright. Come here. Kill this. Do the outsiders have LR? Um, good question. No, thank goodness. They're not leaders, they're just big. This fucker here might also ruin my overwatch. No, I got 98 on it. It should be okay. Yeah, don't let me forget the elites and sectoids next turn. Um, I mean, the NG might actually be the, the better target for the outsiders. Outlaw of no respirator does have Titan. The outsiders shouldn't hit too hard unless every alien gets insane damage climate later on. What we do, you just have to run on it lower off. As there's 11 of that crit, god, jeez, that's a fucking lot. They survive ball to shoot. I think they probably can survive ball, is the thing. You have resilience at least. You have iron skin as well. I think I'm gonna say you'll be okay. I think you can, I think you can be okay here. I mean, it's a dead on AP at least. Probably take it. Come on, me to shreds. No, nah, I don't think so. I think you're better off just doing this because the shred of them there, no way. Give that a crack. Absolutely fucking minimum. Absolute minerals in the club tonight. Went wonderful. Terrific. Okay, and just confirm the smoke. Three, five, seven, seven. Yep, so just put it right there. Yeah, completely worthless grenade there. Just, just garbage. Just absolute garbage. Then smoke. Smoke's up. Yeah, three damage will get literally regen, that's right. At least you're in dense. Kinda worried about the engineer now. Uh, and yeah, just overwatch of you, I guess, is the best I can do here. Oh, the fucking drone. No, fucking bitch. Fuck you. Did you even hit it? Oh, you fucker. At least you didn't do it twice. 
21 on Slayer. Good dodge, keep dodging. That's what you need, you need to dodge right now, Slayer. Good, get the Muton, terrific. Good order of operations. Terrific. Wait, are the Muton Elites gonna spawn in dense smoke? Oh, I should have countered that, fuck. Ow! That hurt. Important dodge, I think the outside is gonna go for you too. Okay, they're on the run. Good shot. They're probably gonna get like a skylight angle on, um... Oh no, good, they're just running. That's good then, that's good. Interesting ass move, you'll be okay. You'll be okay in Titan. The hell is that? That's mutons. Okay, good. Very good turn, Slayer. Well done. Now, before anything, I need to do... And I need to get this exactly right. Th th this is where it's really gonna matter. Oh, okay. They're not even in smoke at all. It's okay. It's actually okay. They're not even in smoke at all. They're along here. They're along the corner of the building. <laughs> Okay, and that's the edge there, right? Okay. No, there it is. Okay, so normally they'd spawn here. No, normally they spawn there. So one, two, th three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh, they're in cover! No! 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 No, it's not right! Drop me to elite. Fuck! How did you know? Okay, and the other one would be where? Because normally I I go left to right, so the other one would be to the right, right there. Actually, perfectly played. Well done. Okay, the other one isn't in cover, but good for you on the first one. And then the sectoids. Seven sectoids. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Those elites are a lot more frightening to me now that one of them's in cover. I won't lie. The outsiders ran. I kind of want to run. I kind of want to get out of here. Do I even have angle on them? No one can even see them, can they? Oh my god, it's like genius. It's like genius positioning, actually. They're so clever. No, power nodes can't be destroyed, can't be collided. Oh my god. The Shiv can't even flank him. If you were out of the way, I can. I could put the Shiv there and go in and flank that one. Watch me with a power heal. Yeah. Should be able to. You come up for reload. Yeah, I was thinking about it. Thinking about how important that command reload might be this turn. I don't want to rocket there because if I blow open the back, I let in even more aliens. It's not a good idea. Don't blow the back out. We can kill one of them and suppress the other. Do we have a collat? Or did I use them all last night? I used them all last turn. Poor. Poor work. Open this. You don't have anything though, unfortunately. That fucking muton is a real... Fucking good use of deep strike rules. I need to contest the zone because I need to kill that one while I can. But that one's gonna remain a problem. There's also the outsider. You can run up to here and then smoke this turn. Meh. 
Okay, we'll flank him with the shiv one time. Maybe I need to get a shredder in there now, I think. Maybe I need them all shredded, because I can't get a shredder there. That's the problem. Oh no, you can! You can get a shredder there, you just couldn't get the outsider, which sucks dick. It's a ranger, man. One more tile, you can get it easy. You could also run the there, but then you're super exposed to the muton. Still, probably shred all of them, but the outsider then. Have Slayer back off to here and reload. Seven. Yeah, Slayer backs off to here. And then we're gonna shred. Where? I need to see this before, because I'm gonna lose sight of them. I need to shred, like, there. Like, a corner tile back from the Seeker, I think. That should, hopefully, get them. So you can just go Abyssal for free. Um, yeah, I guess. Yeah, it works with Pistol. Probably won't do anything to a Seeker, but it's free, and this is the turn that's gonna define the mission, so you may as well take it, I guess. Hey! I mean, that's two damage you didn't have before. Hey! I'm rolling. Okay, let's paramedic you. Minus two. Yeah, yeah, minus two. Heal up. Come on. Back in the fight, maybe so. Power it up. Now is Shred Gaming. Okay. Ready, steady, shreddy. You can actually get a better shreddy now that um, Slayer's not in the way it seems, which is interesting because it didn't work that way. I think right there is your best shreddy. Huh. Please be on target. Cool, got them all. Well done. Good shred. Bing, bing, wahoo. Still can't flank because these fuckers are in the way. If I, I might need to move Slayer again and not reload this turn just to win this turn because if I get the Shiv in, that's going to be massive. So yeah, probably move them both off. Basically, that pistol damage is needed to kill the Seeker would have survived one health. There you go! There you go. By the way, let me cross off my buys so I know I spent them. Good call, chat. You were right. Round of applause for chat. I still haven't moved my soundboard to my SSD, so it's still going to take about five seconds to load a clapping sound effect. But round of applause for chat, everyone. I don't know who said it. I didn't look at their name. Someone had a good idea. I don't know who the fuck it was, but someone had a good idea. Maybe we'll bring Ball over to here. Just to free up more room. Because someone's gonna wanna go there, like Kamaleth, for sure. So, yeah, probably bring Ball around to here. Doesn't matter who said it, we are one. Well, that's good solidarity, I guess. Hey, don't forget, Maya's got a turn as well. Maya, do you wanna go the fuck in this turn? I bet you do. I want you to go the fuck in this turn, Maya. Ball, come over here. Mice is yeah. sure? That's the spirit. Our idea, comrade. Yeah, that's the spirit. Okay, moving Slayer should make this work. Roger that. Yeah, now we've got the one extra tile we needed. Come here. Jam cat, let's go. Aim terrible because Muton Elite very strong. Unfortunately, no one can help with that. Rip Jam Cat? Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Either way, give this a crack. Very good hit. Very needed there. 
excellent hit. Super necessary for that to land, and it did. Excellent. Finally says, by the way, the 22 HP mutant elite will have heat. Yeah, fair enough. So now we can follow up with this, which would be really nice. Where do you want to go? I don't know if you can nade from there. I think you might have to stay here just to get the nade. What can Camelot see? Okay, that's fine, but what Camelot really wants here is to flank the outsider potentially. Well, or flank one of them, so probably Camelot goes to there. I think you've got to stay in this position, Lone Outlaw. You'll be fine. Don't worry about it. You'll be fine. We're going to AP all of them. Which unfortunately is going to lose me a mutant elite body. And I need them, but... Bada bing, bada boom! I'd rather not have elites killing me. So let's go. Let's go for more damage this time. Oh, I got a floater! Cool, I got a floater. <laughs> I forgot that floater even existed! <laughs> Alright. That's good. Now we have Maya, Stormy, and Gamaleth. So Gamaleth can come to the flank here, as discussed. Roger that. that looks like position very chargeable, Maya. I agree. Very, very chargeable. You need to damage on the outsider more, but let's confirm that we get the Muton first, I think. Maya enters the fray. I might actually want Maya to not take cover. Oh, but she has to to get the flank. Well, no, you can go here. You might want Maya to not take cover so that she wears it instead of the shiv, because she's much tankier than the shiv is. She can wear it much better. Three, five, seven, 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 five. So I probably put Maya here. Shotgun the elite. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That might even make the Muton run and Bull maybe picks them up. I think Bull's in the wrong spot for that now, unfortunately. I shouldn't have moved Bull there. Shouldn't have moved Bull here, but whatever. Whatever. Okay, yeah. Maya. Runinagunne. B says, before you move Maya, have you checked whether you have a land on top of your library? <laughs> and he says, actually, if you use Maya to tank kill Elite. Yeah. Elite top 16 damage outside of top 11. Yeah, exactly. I want to kill the Elite everywhere. I'm way more scared of them. Why just kill the Elite with rifles? Because look at the damage to kill both of them. The rifle, maybe if it crits, kills the Elite, but probably not. The rifle definitely doesn't kill the Outsider. So I want to use a gun that's likely to kill the elite, so that I'm used be, and then I can just use the rifle to add some damage to the outsider, and then Bull can kill them. Elite is shredded, doesn't need a crit. Oh, I don't know. Even with shred, I don't know if it's enough. I think it's more likely that the ally cannon kills the elite. Camelef hits and damages the outsider low enough that Bull can kill them. I think that's the better order of operations here. Can you gonna hit that elite in the front of the tire of the truck? The gunner can't move and shoot. They're a, they're an HMG. All right. If you're also going to kill, yeah. I'm I'm not gonna go for rolls here though. I'm just gonna go in and do it. Understood. Moving out. I'm okay with Maya tanking a hit from over there. I think. Oh. No. <laughs> Die. Work. That'll buy us a little. Bit. We just need to find that bomb. Shoot. Nice. I'm running low on ammo. Bull should have that covered easy. Now you just want to bring up Dalmatian and get another smoke in. There's still another outsider out right there, so you can watch out for that. I, w I really thought those elites were jokes, but they turned out to be a little more scary than I thought. I'm glad that shiv hit. 70% for the rifle kill, by the way. Yeah, I like the short thing even more than knowing that. Three. This has to be perfect. Three. They will run in the swipe of smoke, won't matter. Three, five. Three, five. Ugh. 
357775. 35, okay, 3577. So that tile right there, 3577. 3577. Okay, just in line with here to there. Now it says it'll get the outsider, but it actually shouldn't. That should be a lie. Yeah, exactly, Ben, exactly. It should only get Maya. Yeah, uh, XCOM 2 actually has a mode like that, Spots. I've kind of... I XCOM 2 has a mode like that. Please remind me next time we play XCOM 2 to check it out again. Because I remember trying it once, and I was like, this is amazing. I made like this cool little like mini movie clip in it in like five, five minutes. It was really easy with an Xbox controller. And then I never used it again because I just didn't have the effort, uh, the energy to do it. Um, and I forgot how to access it. And to this day, I still wonder, did I gaslight myself? Did that really exist? The TLP? No, th there's like a mode in like Vanilla XCOM 2 onwards. I, that is like a tactical replay mode where you can load... You load a save of a mission and it replays all the turns of that mission. I never hear anyone talk about it. What? Yeah, it's real. I've never heard anyone talk about it. I swear to God it's real. I remember I remember playing around with it with an Xbox controller for the camera to take cinematic movies. Um, I think I accessed it through the extra dev options in the main menu splash. I think it's like the tactical quick start somehow. I don't remember how I did. This is what I mean. No one ever talks about it, and I couldn't remember how to do it again. But I swear to god it's real, and I always intended to use it to make really fucking cool XCOM 2 movies, but I just never got around to it because, you know, effort. But I want to go back and use it sometime because it's so fucking cool. I don't know if it's challenge mode. Skimish mode, you can create your own scenarios? No, I'm talking about literally, like, it was a thing that replayed the mission. You didn't need the dev tools at all, I don't think, Bounty. It was just, like, the, the, you know, when you get the, the version of the main menu that has all, like, the dev stuff? It was one of those options. I gotta figure out how to do it again, because I swear to God, it's real, and it was super cool. One of those guys replays for a while? Yeah, XCOM 2 has that. The Zora says I found a replay mode that improves the replay UI. Link it to me. Someone knows about it, then. Yeah, it's real as fuck and it's super cool. It's super fucking cool. Uh, I might bring you up here with them, Stormy. Just to make sure that if there's a shot up here, it's... They're gonna be okay. Oh no, they're fucked. They've, they've got minus defense. They're gonna get targeted for sure. But at least if I put Stormy up there, Stormy can handle the outsider on the roof as well. Drug that Stormy? Uh, maybe... Yeah, thanks. I'll carry that link for later. Load replay. Maybe it was just a mod on its own. I don't know. Yeah, no, there you go. Enables the replay feature in non-debug builds. Adds a button to the replay interface to hide the controls and start playing. Yep, you can jump into the replay at any turn, too. You can be like, all right, I'll take over now. I always thought it'd be cool to like let you guys send in your replays to me, and then I could jump in and be like, here's what I'd do. But I never did it. Yeah, dev feature. You may kind of crash the soft locks. Yeah, because it's a bit buggy because it's a dev feature. Yeah, it's it's fucking cool as shit. Oh yeah, I'll I'll load those for later too. Those Reddits on how to do it. And he says, "Lol, you literally subscribe to the mod that has a load replay button to the main menu." There you go. Yeah. Super fucking cool. Anyway, the the more you didn't know, apparently, everyone. Now you know. You know what I might do with Stormy actually is put her over here to hold the left side, or even just like hold here. But I think you might she might just shoot through there. One. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Guys, I fucked up. I forgot that there's 7 sectoids and 2 mutons stuck back here. Ball might have been placed into a bad position, I just realized. I may have fucked up. I'm like, kind of checking now. I think all the aliens are still just fucking around back there. I think it'd be okay. Yeah, I think it'd be okay. But anyway, let's go and sit over there just in case. Let's go and watch from that side. Let's reload you. You're gonna hold the left side when they come. We're gonna take the bomb anyway. You're gonna overwatch with this turn. I think it'll be fine. You're in dense. 
You're in dents. They're not in dents. It's meant to be a refuge. I mean, yeah, it's not ideal, but it is survivable. Who not Overwatch? That's the turn. Go, go. Yeah, I always wanted to do that in Burnout. Exactly. Save your XCOM 2 campaigns. But I never got around to it. Should do it sometime. Hi, drone. Maybe if I can make OVA, like, installable by mortals and not insanely complicated to install, then maybe I could get more of you to play OVA with me and I could play your OVA campaigns. 54% a mile. Ow. Bongo. 69% a mile. Damage control, thank you very much. Cover my flank. They're running it. They're gonna die tired. You done. Get them the F out of here. Running dry on ammo. That there is why I insisted on a recipe still for Maya. Because you Johnny Love made sure that you could not make anyone that tanky and longer anymore. Even Maya, who looks really tanky, you still can only take like a few hits. You can't take that much, you know. Being able to take it as all is good, but she's not invulnerable. But she did her job well there. That's exactly what we needed her to do. Now it's uh, flank gamer time. Yeah, she's not even winded. Now if you save her, she's goaded. Honestly, the best tank would be someone who rolls Savior Paramedic on themselves. Can you imagine? It'd be like XCOM 2, like with the single action med kits. She just like has, imagine her with like Paramedic Savior. She just like has a turn like that, heals herself, just goes again. Oh, definitely Slink, definitely as well. Okay, no Kaladi on you, no ammo for it. Lord Outlaw can Kaladi. You probably wanna like, well, you can only collect one of these is a thing. Sidney says, you think the last two mutons plus sectoids have lost those close quarter spots? Nope, because there is no way in. They're stuck back here. That's the beauty of it. Did you get her side good enough to mind merge them? Yeah, that's true. I forgot about mind merge DR. And the side screen. I did forget about mind merge DR. I forgot that's part of the calculations. That run and gun. I might have to pick my poison here. I think, because I can only collapse one of them. The Shiv can flank this Muton, but that won't be enough to kill them solo. I guess the shotgun together might be, but probably still not enough damage. So I think you just collapse the Muton this turn and suppress the Outsider. I think that's the smartest series of events. Okay. So come here. I don't want to rocket obsidian because it opens up the back and that's just actively bad for me right now. Okay, so collat that open. Get that meat. Blow that meat up. I feel like obsidian is like my at work, like, commander intern on this mission. So he's like, what about this commander? I'm like, no, Obsidian, we would not do that. What about this commander? Obsidian, I don't think we do that either. <laughs> oh, Camelot's got shots too, perfect. But you're learning, Obsidian. You're learning. Something about saying that maybe you want to play with Sigma again so bad. I want to have those... I guess I want to make some more Imperial Guard officer candidates. <laughs> Getting it done. Let me see if I open this if the gunner can see you. It's possible. Yes, you can! This is why I'm the best in the world. I'm not. Don't listen to him, he's not. I miss Sigma. Yeah, everybody does. We love Sigma. We all love Sigma around here. I think I'm just gonna get you healed. Sigma balls! Sigma balls to you as well, brother! See ya. Okay. You're one of the world. I am one of the world's XCOM players. That's true. 
I am one of them. Flush. Nah, I've only got one shot in the tube. I don't think it's worth it. Better to just suppress them. But I do really want to get um, Maya healed this turn. Just in a position where Tango Dash won't be hurt. So probably just come here. That's right, Benny. Well, OVA and Resigma both fit those bills. Moving to position. Oh, that's a really good idea too, Benny. We should go up on the roof. Let me heal your ass up to the moon. Oh, you don't have savior. Not to the moon at all. You'll be back in the fight ASAP. Problem having so much health takes a while to heal ya. Oh yeah, Mars Tactics soon too, I hope. Mars Tactics is looking great. I can't wait to play that again. Glory to manhole. I probably should have healed you instead, actually. Let's just get you to here for now, Moving. I think. Reload. To go. I should go over the roof for those sectoids. You got dense smoke there still. I'm just gonna run in, eh? I'm just gonna, like, run... I think you to here. Or maybe to here into the dents for right this turn. Perseguida. We will reload your pistol for collateral. Good to go. You can run in as well. Or maybe to here. No, 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 no. Yeah, you run to here. I'm on it, Commander. We're just gonna call at you and kill you next, so we don't have to flank you or anything. Just gonna suppress you this turn. I think it's my turn to uh, reload you. It's killing time. Reload you. Maya gets the meat next turn. <laughs> no you! And we're gonna get that bomb soon. Soonish. Let's just get you collateral immediately. Okay, great. Kamaleth, everybody else, have fun. Obsidian has light up here, actually. Perfect. Gamer mode activated. Destroyed. Now you just gotta worry about getting the bomb and, and this shit on the left. Okay! Damn, Rocket with Eyes is really good. Yeah, because Rocket counts as a miss, it is really good. Even when the Rocket was 100, it counts as a miss. That is really good. Really nice. Very cool. Okay, now I think we just bring Ball back to- Oh, that's perfect, yeah. Just watch the long from here. a perfect spot for ball down that alleyway. Heal up. Someone is going to get the bomb. I guess it'll be you. Easy now, soldier. Both the assaults are just like, me, 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 Dalmatian, me, me, no, me, me. I need healing. Mata, mata. I could also just send the bomb robot to do it. Reload you. Reload you. Reload you. Reload everybody, I think. You can start going upstairs to rain grenades on them. Yes, man. It feels as a trap, right? Yeah, we don't want to do it until we kill the others. So we should get on the defusing quickly. Yes, more I mean, we should get on to killing the others quickly so that we can handle that. That business. I should get you to yeah, here. Boy. Reload you. Back online. Oh, you have lock and load. Cool. 
Do you think there's a huge button that says off on the bottom to make a robot accessible? No, I think it's just like like R2D2. I think Jam Cat will just walk up to it and a little prong will come out. <laughs> yeah, everybody knows the whistle, but everybody's favorite is the fucking scream. Why is R2D2 just like a little goblin? Have you ever thought about that? Okay, I, I was gonna do like a trick here. Maybe, maybe actually we just defuse now. Cause I was gonna do a little trick here where I collided this open to make like a bomb defusal hole. But it's fine, I don't think they're like holding the corner or anything. I think they're all like, yeah, just like stuck back here. I think we just like defuse now. And get ready for the Thin Mittens to come. And then just deal with them. Like, put the assaults behind me. And then we'll just, like, slowly, sadly deal with the, the ones trapped behind. I can give you a rocket. Maybe. More likely, Thin Men are gonna spawn in there and I'll rocket them. I really want to just rocket all the sectoids of the city, honestly. That's actually what I want to do is just, like, put a rocket through here and just destroy them all. There's, like, one, two, three, four. Oh, my God. Five, six. Are they actually trapped? No, they can get out. They just don't really know how. There's, like, a one tile over here you can get out through, but they don't really want to do that. Jake never taught them how to do that here. Oh, my God. Maybe I kill them before the Thin Men after all. I'll get less Sectoid bodies, but I'll get more fun. Nah, I think Thin Men first. Will be easier. I keep changing my mind, but... Thin Men first will probably be easier. Okay, you come here. No, maybe not, actually. I need, I need more people upstairs to deal with the fuckers. Let's have... You come here. You come here. You... Come over here. And reload. You overwatch there. You overwatch there. Shiv ready for action. Shiv can just go through fences apparently. Heal for you. Rub some dirt on it, you wimp. <laughs> she just runs over the fences. Yeah, like that GDI cutscene from the start of CNC one, baked into my brain. Roger that. Oh yeah, smena magazina. Ya podemos seguir. Scanning cool. Overwatching. Green to Slayer go. says rude Dalmatian dash. Yeah, but did you like it? But he says Slayer cover the wrong side, so I should be close to the sectors and mop them. After, yeah. After, but I'm more worried about dealing with the thin men behind me who are gonna drop in first. Then we'll deal with them, because they're just stuck right now, I think. So this is better what than dying. Sound? There you go. Let's try to open now in case the mutons kill the ship and I need to scramble. That would be hilariously sad. On such a one mission. Because there is a chance a muton like overwatches me around the corner or something, but it shouldn't happen. I still have nodes in a turn to deal with it if it happens. Beep beep. Hello. Zabomba. 
Now you just need to take out any active hostiles still in your locale. Activate strike one. You've got hostile forces about to hit your position. We have a new objective. The bomber activato. Beeper. <laughs> Beeper. That's right. Beeper. Already there. You can watch over here. Have a watch. Where is the least likely to get a random angle on you from? Probably here. Copy that. Yeah, you'll be fine there. You'll be fine. On my way. Okay, overwatching everyone. Got it covered. It's in time. You hear that? Sky says, man, it gets real quiet just after disarming the bomb. Yeah, because it's like your tinnitus is gone. You didn't realize you were listening to that humming the whole time. Isn't it great to just hear clearly now? It's awesome. This is the power of video games. They give you fantasies and fulfillments. Unfortunately, in real life, I'll never get rid of my tinnitus. Hello! One. Two. One. Two. Three. I should have brought lightning reflexes over here. Four. Five. Can you stop? And <laughs> you missed. Shot failed to connect. Here's one, two, three. Where's the fourth one? One, two. In the pit? Three. Oh, yeah, back there with them, right? With the toys. <laughs> right. Yeah, my mistake here is I didn't bring lightning reflexes back to the back. Silly boy, now you're going to get shot at. No, no. Probably just come and watch him move ball. Just tank it. Yeah, I'm probably gonna. I am wearing the Titan, that's right. Probably just run over here. Well, you can hit this on this one, though. Yeah, you can end on that one if you play your cards right. You might not even activate the Overwatch if you're a real gamer. I am a real gamer, you know what? I am. But wait, couldn't Dalmatian also just kill that one then? Yes. I have a better turn here, hang on. I have a much better turn. So you're not going to get spotted, so you run to here. Moving out. Gaming! Damn. But moving up. <laughs> the healing is not as rewarding as the hurting. <laughs> I get CE or I get one shot. I think one shot is better with the crits. Sprint and spray. Gaming! Yes, what are you gonna do? Shoot me? Ah! <laughs> oh my god, I shot him and he didn't stop! No! <laughs> the fucking ragdoll! be sick. Holy shit, the rat <laughs> <laughs> Like, shut up. It, like, fucking shoulder checked. Shoulder checked him into the brick wall. <laughs> that was great. Okay. Yeah, delicious acid. That's right. Yeah, it's always something with this game. In it. 
Isn't it just? Okay, one, two, three, four. Great. Everybody get ready for fun incoming. That means you mean, right? Not immune to DR. To the anti-DR properties, only to the, to the rest. Okay, everybody get over here. We're gonna have a good time. Hot Tando, you're you're ready to go. Shiv. Shiv Shiv can chill, I guess. Shiv Shiv should get out of there, really. Beep beep. Oh my, what the fuck? Yeah, that's kind of the plan banzer, yeah. Containment breach. Oh, yeah, the really fucking The Sectoid's right there! Roger. I've got my eyes. Roll. Someone said We're toy, but I didn't go. say it. <laughs> Baby is escape containment. <laughs> why reload those three? Well, why not? This still a thermo of jumpy legs? Oh shit! I forgot, that's why. Oh no! song you know what song play while they were doing that the thin man does that and all you can hear is this <laughs> thanks so much thin man excellent work these are the guys who want the basements by the way yeah oh my they moved into a flanked position <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> they do all that shit just to flank themselves. What the fuck? Oh no! There's there's fucking one more of them. The squad says. Whoa, psh, psh, runs past them, doesn't shoot them as they're wide-eyed. Back down, kicks in the door, in jumps. Kamalev shoots them. Why? <laughs> Why did that happen? It's like everyone in dead chat is watching you in a multiplayer shooter and you're like, oh, I'm locked in. And then you're like, not locked in and everyone laughs at you. <laughs> My god. That was insane. Moving. Well, all the thin men are dead. He found the coolest way to get flanked. I agree. That is the coolest self-flank I've ever seen in any turn-based tactics game. Definitely. I've never seen it that good before. I, I would agree. That's affirmative. My god. My god, Gordon! <laughs> Fuck me! There's still a fucking sectoid over here! <laughs> they're still oh no, they're in a truck! <laughs> Do it! <laughs> no! That's a canyon arrow! Get away from it! <laughs> oh my god, they're actually alive. Good for them. Hmm. Okay, stop laughing. The laughing almost got me killed. I, I need to stop laughing so much. <sighs> That's how I forgot about the thing. <laughs> it did nothing. Where do we want to rock at? We're going to wait till the Evers get here. Just chill for now. The only thing that could have made that better is if I had overwatched and all three of them had missed while they were doing the Thin Man Matrix dodge. I'm kind of sad. What could have been? Overwatch, aye, aye. But maybe it would have killed them and we never would have seen that. I mean, with the shotgun, probably. 
Reloaded. Steady. <laughs> that Thin Man Matrix dodge is gonna be one of the top gaming clips of all time, I think. You all know the one, right? On the on the, the desert tile set landed supply barge. Jumping up to the roof of it and doing the matrix dodge on the shot. That is an amazing clip. I've never seen anything so beautiful as that. Except for Jam, of course. You still have the matrix dodge with him? Hell yeah. The sectoid's fine. Oh no. When you blow up one car, you get two. Might as well be playing GTA. Like when GTA 3 first came out, I was like, you know what's so fun? Lining up like 20 cars and having them all explode at the same time. That game was a great sandbox. Solid copy, Commander. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that game. I also like how this one sector is broken free and is using their freedom to just heal all the others. Uh, my merge all the others who are still here. They're waiting, they're like, eventually. Eventually we'll be freed. I mean, they're correct. They just don't know in what capacity they're correct, unfortunately. I am going to free them. Do they want to flank me? Is that why they're all here? One, two, oh my god, one, two, three. Oh, is there one there too? Holy shit, I gotta move obsidian. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, they want freedom. Obsidian, you need to move over. They are begging for freedom over here. You must give it to them. Mm, actually, if you move over, you'll still have a shot that isn't ideal. But you'll get this corner, that's what really matters. Is Are we, like, good to do that this turn? No, we're waiting for him. Wait for him. Okay. I think if you come to here, you can get an even better shot, actually. Yeah, just back up. I know the rocket won't elevate, but just in case, just back up one, a couple of you. Just in case it does. You can come over here. Position confirmed. Get ready to drop down. And have shots. Okay. Je surveille the watch. You come catch up. On the move. I wonder if the person who ordered these two mutons and seven sectoids, well, there was two different people, but I wonder if they're, one must imagine them happy with their order. One must imagine them pleased. They must be very proud of this sector on the left. What was that sound? And definitely very proud of the other six in a different way for sticking together. Dr. Ryu says, no, nah, I mean, this is what Seven Sectoids is supposed to do. <laughs> if the bomb was back there, just fuck around, says Dr. Ryu. <laughs> Sectoids are like, oh no. Sectoids are like space station assistants. Oh, another great shot! Il est mort. Sectoids are like space station 13 assistants. They're just there to fuck around. Yeah, I agree with that. That's a good call. They're just there to wander around and ask the other aliens, like, what should I do? You can make, like, a children's book out of that. So the sector asked the muton, should I suppress, like, Mew Muton? And the muton said, no, little sector, you don't have the health. Scurry along, find another alien to help. So the sector found the seeker and said, seeker, should I help you in infiltrating the enemy lines? The seeker said, no, little sectoid, you can't disguise yourself like I can. Go and find someone else to help, sectoid. That's, that's my children's book, that's how it starts. I don't know how it ends. I didn't think that far ahead. Here, come get a little bit Roger closer. Muton, can I have sec key? That's not what I was thinking of. <laughs> Reload. I'm ready. Would go up bald head be in your book, Beagle? Maybe I'll ban you. What do you think of that? Maybe that'll be in my book. 
Barley says it ends with the sector with carry and while X comes out of runs out of arc charges as they execute them. No, but this can be like a like a Chimera I'll squad like book. The little sectoid finally ends up running up to XCOM after all the aliens won't let him help and says, a little, X a little XCOMs, Mr. and Mrs. XCOMs, can I help you defend the world? Of course, little sectoid, they say while New getting the bag ready behind zero, them. Zero donation from Tychrasis. One glass of water, but a complimentary order for the chef. Time to hydrate. Oh, good idea. Thank you. I will drink. Thank you very much. Ah. Andrew says ends with the sectoids forming a cube and killing XCOM themselves by frying the commander's brain. What the fuck? No! Edo. That actually probably is how the book should end, is the sectoids finally ask the lonely sectoid asks another lonely sectoid, can I help you? And they're like, sure, and then they form the sectoid cube, and then they win. <laughs> and the moral of the story is teaching children at a young age uh, to form unions uh, for vested interests. Uh, I think that's the moral of the story anyway. Aye, aye, Commander. We're green that's together. right, Sectoid's unionizing via cube. Exactly, exactly. The little Sectoid that could unionize. <laughs> my one, uh, small business owner, my, my one business owner viewer is like, Damn it, he's talking about unionizing again! I can't watch this content anymore! Every weekend! <laughs> Alright, show me where the targets are. It's time for Obsidian to waste a bunch of bodies. Oh, they're still there. <laughs> Gaming time. Knock knock. Oh no! All those sectoids! All those hamburgers! Oh no! Which means the mutons must be here. Which is even more oh no. Maintain the cube, little sectoids. That's right! Don't be scared, maintain the cube. Oh shit, Bull can actually fucking see them from here. That's fucked up. Alright. Someone nade the mutons. Where the mutons at? They over here. Hello. Grenade for you. Wait, there's only one muton. Weren't there two trap back here, or did one run out at me or something? Am I actually about to get messed up? I don't think so. Where's uh, Slayer? It's Slayer gaming time. Slayer, come here. After Bull does what Bull has to do. No, Camelith will do it. After Camelith does, I mean, after Dalmatian does. Hurrah. Slayer, uh, more XP for you time, I think. Yes, Commander. Oh, not that way. That's Clear dangerous. Oh, God. I did not think you would run that way. I'm all right. That's fine. You ran off the screen so they couldn't hit you anymore. See, I knew I had a sixth sense of something hilariously bad is about to happen to me. It's okay. Bonk. Bonk. Good 
Oh, God. That's it. Bomb disarmed. Secure the site and head for the Sky Ranger. Whoa! Da Beige! Da Beige! $200 donation! 100.00 donation from Da Beige. Woo! Bigs. Yes. Long time lurker and content enjoyer going back to LW14, maybe earlier. Long time. Keep up the great content. Over 10 years. Or I think actually 2014 was Long War 14 about then. Long War point whatever it was. What am I saying? 14 might just be Long War 14. Anyway, keep the great content. Thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed this mission as well. Or maybe you just pop straight in. $200 donation and you didn't even buy... Uh, 13 cyber disc with it. Thank you very much. I appreciated a ton. Big team dub here. Thank you. Thank you very much. That is super kind of you. Appreciate it. A very nice cherry on top. Perfect. Turn right at the end of this bomb mission. That went incredibly well. It went incredibly well. Thank you so very much. I appreciate that. It's insanely generous from you. Thank you so much. Very, very nice of you. Thank you so very, very, very much, 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 much. I'm very kind of you. I do hope you're enjoying. That bomb mission definitely went well. The squad, I wasn't sure if they were going to be good enough, but um, basically Slayer was carrying hard. Because it's a CQB map, so I thought Slayer would be alright, but I didn't know how good they'd go. Good lord. Um, in the zone on shotguns is actually pretty good, it turns out. Yeah. Imagine that with like VPT and Ranger. God damn, that was pretty good. And crit perks. <laughs> no, says, wait, I can get 13 cyber discs for $200. I didn't see that on the menu. I don't think you can, actually. <laughs> I don't think you even can. God, so many people bought so much money on the base defense. Mediocre says, anybody who remembers Iron Man Impossible, please also remember to take your back medicine. <laughs> oh, yeah. That wasn't intentional. I didn't mean to snort like a pig. Thank you again, the bees, for the $200 donation. Super nice of you. Thank you very much. So generous. Thank really you so much. On this one. I'm glad everyone made it back safely. Okay. So kind of you, the beach. Thank you. Interesting. You get another shredder, I think, Obsidian. You're a good rocketeer. You get... Really, the only good choice here is shredder, yeah. Just more rocket. That's a good one, though. That's really good. You are a good Rocketeer, now an extra Shredder as well. That's really good. Yeah, there's RTS here, there's Repair Servos, but no, I definitely, definitely want the Shredder, I think. Norris says, actually, when I found you, Beagle, which I made it possible while car caring for my dad in hospice. I'm sorry that that was what you were having to do at the time, but uh, hopefully you enjoyed the content at the time. But yeah, it's going back, right? I made it possible, it's going back. We kind of member that. We kind of do a member that, I think, every month at least once, right? Repair servers, yeah, it's all about the rockets. Yeah, should I have my yeah, you do, but this will give you an extra shredder rocket. Is what it'll do, so that'll be really nice. Just remember the jingle. Mm. The back and the do. Okay. That's pretty nice for someone who wants to run in with Titan. I don't mind that. For a close encounters Titan Assault. Yeah, that's not bad. Extra HP as well. Slayers from my tank and it went, yeah, resilience is good, yeah. This isn't a person who wants to clown. This is the person who's got way better things to do than clown. So we don't take smoke and mirrors on Slayer specifically here. Definitely go harder on the CQB jump here. No, this is a good break from a tough time. Like the beach, appreciate the content, even though I don't have 13 Sabbath money. That's all good. I'm just glad you, you enjoy it. That's all good. Thanks for being here. Okay, yeah, the resilience definitely good there. Let's grab that. And you roll another hit points. So you're up to nine now. Awesome. You are getting to those Maya levels now. If you roll EC, you are you are like a killer Maya. Which perk did the obsidian get? Shredder, which we're going to take now. Extra Shredder Rocket. Pretty good Rocketeer there. Pretty damn good. Everything by the numbers. I got one Elite Corpse. Five set of Corpses. Huge aim roll. What was the aim? Plus five on Obsidian? Wait. Really? Obsidian roll plus five? Remember, we will be watching. 
Where is Obsidian? Oh damn, 97 aim. Not bad at all. Not bad, Obsidian. Not fucking bad. Very good. Is Slayer gened? I got a gene mod Slayer and give him iron skin too. No, Slayer is not- no, Slayer is gened. Do you have iron skin? No, I need to give Slayer iron skin. For more CQ being. Bandy says, doubly good on an Ellie Rocketeer's like Venture is back. Yeah, Obsidian's living, living Venture's memory on at this point. Need to give my second heart? Yeah, though I haven't got that yet. I can do Elite Utopsy now though, that's nice. Just a bunch of autopsies right now, really. Okay, cool. Carry on gaming. That was uh, that was a good one. I should have a menu prepared. Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. I don't have a menu prepared for next month, so... Huh, I wasn't expecting to be so quick today. Commander. We'll probably Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. So let's buy Exalt and... <laughs> no! No buying Exalt. I need money at the end of this month to go, um... I guess I should get more interceptors so I can cover South America as well. Honestly, these interceptors have been holding pretty strong. Once I got Phoenix, I needed less interceptors than before, I guess, because once you got Phoenix, one interceptor could do the job of two or three. However, I should still buy a couple more Phoenix cannons if I can afford the alloys so that I can get, for next month, South America covered. Yeah, I can buy one. Seeing so says, just promise me you won't waste my extra small item slot on a filthy collar. I don't know, you're pretty good. We might have to. Plan to try and liberate Africa? I mean, eventually we need to do a base assault if we don't lose anywhere else, so yeah. Don't do that. Nice job, girl named Captain. You finally got through. Well done. Well done. Who else wants to, uh, Psy Gaming? Anybody? Anybody keen? A lot of these people never been on a mission, so they can't do side gaming. You've only got a few choices. Uh, Jay Coombe, it's probably your time. Jay Coombe with 47 will. You're probably better off neural feedbacking. You don't have a lot of will. Though with flashbangs... Hmm. Nah, feedback's better, I think, you. Bandy Giver is back in service. More alloys, which means we can buy another Phoenix Cannon for next month. What are they just finished building? What? what I've, my my short-term memory is shot. What did I just finish building? What was that size skill that was grayed out? Oh, order rifle, right? Thank you. Um, we don't have the thing for it yet. Sky and I have to do more interrogations and stuff. Contact detected. Hello, hello. NOE large over China. What's going on? Have a go, have a look. Shoot it, we don't Engaging shoot it. Bogey. We're about firestorms. We lost the bubble. Abducto. Probably an abduction then. Yeah, Commander. We're receiving Lights. several urgent requests for assistance. There are abductions in progress at each marked site on the Hologlobe. What do you mean, Light? I know you guys got the resources. What are you doing with all that money? Are you gonna, like, infiltrate a country and just take one? What do you spend all your resources on? Why is it a light? They're pranking you? Yeah, it's like a light in the country that has the least panic. They spend it all on the trap UFO? I don't... I mean... I don't know about that. Unknown, no intel is available. What the fuck? What do you mean? What? Why don't you know what the map is? 
I've never seen that before. Oh no, no intel is available. But I have a sat over it. What? It must be, yeah, it must be friends in low places like Bounty says. It has to be one of the maps that doesn't normally show up. It, it might be friends in low places, I think Bounty's right. Okay. I mean, gear up for it. Let's go. <laughs> Rafa Raggy, we got a mystery. <laughs> Who's going on this one? I'd like to level up uh, the VPT Mayhem Ranger lady some more. Let's get her ready. Philip is open close quarters. Makes sense. Is friends in low places open close quarters? Bring me. I need to level up some more. Says so Slayer. I think you're in fatigue, my man. But I agree. Usually, let me go to the wiki. I just come along more wiki. There's map tables, and we should be able to see what UCQ maps there are on the wiki at least. Map table. Urban warfare. Urban close quarters. Sort by a. Oh, I wish I had com um, companion installed. Demolition EW. But that one would have a that one would have a screenshot. Fast food would have a screenshot. Fa fast food EW would have a screenshot. Small cemetery would have a screenshot. So yeah, it has to be low friends. It's the version of smiling friends you haven't heard of. Okay, cool. Andrew says, Beagle, bring me, I need to level up more. Oh, we got like an armor session going or something, Banzer, I didn't know about? I think Friends in Low Places is typically good for snipers because it's very open. You can like snipe the entire map. But you also, it depends where you start, I guess. Depends what side of the map you start on. And you could, it is quite close. Like, we're going to need to be. It's quite close, but it's not really like a shotgun flanking map. It's more of like an infantry range map. Let's get Cat Girl in on a mission. Give her a turn. It's her turn. There she goes. Headless and soft cover. You can break most of the cover to shoot the graves. Yeah, yeah. It's like Kaladigan is good. Slippo, maybe? Who else would I take? Hit and run low profile. Nah, probably slip out to carry. In the zone, snapshots. Probably slip out to carry. Someone's got to carry this, but then we also want to take our people we want to level. Girl named Captain says, let me have that commander. I ain't seen action in ages. That's true, you haven't. Are you a clown? You are a... Yeah, you're a dense smoke clown. Okay, you and you have H&R. You can go on the mission. You can be our clown. I'm clowning. Yeah, it's all about the clowns now, girl. You can come. Since you've been in service, we've, we've really shifted to a clown-based meta. Killers on the left, clowns on the right. Is how I'm gonna lay out my squad laydowns. That made sense how I said that. Dos computer with light em up, hollow but bad aim. But shredder. So smoke or is that just no, no yeah, come on drugs, okay. You're a bit clowny. We need a good rocketeer. Who's gonna be my good rocketeer? We have Combat Drugs Javelin Zakam. Kinda cool. I think for a second Rocketeer that'd be good, but I don't think your main Rocketeer. Savior. Heat Warheads. Nah, you're, again, you're a good clown. You're, it's minus one Medic, so I can bring you instead of a Medic. Well, I haven't revived, but you know what I mean. Could bring you. You have smoke as well. 
a good little clown, aren't you? You got the rockets, you got high aim, you got smoke and mirrors. You're, you're a good little clown, you could maybe come on the mission. But not as the main rocketeer, but as, but as another one. But I need more killers. Anyone like close to getting out of the, the bays? Not close enough. Where are my killers? I might need double sniper, like uh, Abu Hero double tap hit and run. Low profile. And then probably Leah. Because I need to try and level her into having more shots. Okay, so bring Abu as well. And then bring her, bring Brazen Bull. That's a lot of damage. Now I need like some reliable midliners. Maybe no IO. I kind of need a good gunner, yeah? Like Dang Tank. Or someone of EC would be great. Zyber Swifty says, I have no idea what's going on right now. Feel free to ask. Um, we're just loading out our squad of training related up random perk soldiers, and then we're gonna go on the mission in hopefully like 10 to 20 minutes and kill some aliens. And then people spend money to put more aliens in the mission, because that's how we roll around here. Maybe dank tank. It's more clowning. There's also some tanking. But you do bring some dank. And you got mayhem for more damage, so you're kind of in the middle. If you had better aim, you're a bit of a killer. Zyber Shifty says, are you looking at a list of people that want to join your lobby or something? Man, that would be fucking awesome. No, these these are like, these, this isn't multiplayer. These are just soldiers under my command in this single player game. That would be kind of fucking awesome though. If you guys, I, I, I can see you would think that because they're named after the chatters. That'd be kind of fucking awesome if it was an MMO. I was the, like, Natural Selection 2, I was the commander, and you guys are all right now in chat going like, Let me in! I want to be on the mission! And then you actually control your moves. <laughs> I know we've talked about that before, but that would be awesome. It's just armor? Yeah, I guess that's just armor. Yeah. I need someone better. I need, like... I was really impressed by that shotgunner. I kind of want another one that can do that. That was what he says, let me ask that would have been so cool, it's exactly what I thought was happening. It's possible to do that, it would just be really unwieldy. I could use Parsec to let people do that, but it would be unwieldy. So one day I should try that though, because it is possible, it's been done. I, it would just be a hell of a thing to logistically organize. Someone should make a game that is just based around that. An XCOM that's just based around that, it has like the netcode just built in for it, that'd be great. Okay, I need a medic, I think. I guess if I want a shotgun or a medic, I could bring you with CE, light them up, flush, aggression. Mind fray, 71A mind fray, that's not bad. 71 will mind fray, I mean. But symmetry brings the scans, which will also be really good with as many snipers, so probably symmetry over you. Girl named Cat, Rocketeer, Gunner, Medic. Yeah, yeah, something like that, Mohora, maybe, but you, I'd rather use Parsec and people would remote into my computer instead. It's how we did XCOM 2 multiplayer. You just had to do that with, like, instead of switching to the alien turn, let them do it during my turn, and you'd have to have, like, seven people, eight people in the, in the Parsec at once. It would be really laggy and it would not work very well, but it is technically possible. You could do it, you just wouldn't really want to, I think. Maybe another person with more scanners and more med kits, but then I have no shotguns. I could bring an infantry of shotguns, hit around a light them up and more smoke. And then all your killings really in these three. And then you have like a good smattering of damage across the others, but I don't have a mainline rocketeer, it's a little bit worrying. But I still have heat, I still have a heat rocketeer of high aim. That's still good. I have a lot of smoke. Kami only needs one mission XP. Mm, I should try to fit Kami then. But I really want battle scanners. I want a lot of battle scanners. You have EC too. That's perfect. You have a future ahead of you. Maybe Kami can go on the next one. I think this squad might be good. 
Title scanners are betrayers? No, they're our friends. We believe in them. They're our friends. Do you need to rename these? Um... Hey, yeah, Lewis is a raffle! Exclamation mark raffle, y'all! And how is a raffle? Exclamation mark raffle, we got two soldiers! Up for grabs! Get your exclamation mark raffle in, type it in chat. You can be one of these soldiers. I was just swinging my arm for some reason when I was saying that. I don't know, like you could see it. Double tap, hit and run, in the zone, save your dead eye, secondary heart. You are GLRing now, buddy. You are true sniping. Where's GLR go? Who's got it? You do. No, you're gonna have to lose that. You're gonna have to alloy strike rifle instead. Which is good because you have precision shot. You get the GLR. You get to take maximum aim. Maximum speed. Good for you, Schlippo. Um. Yep, 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 yep. So, Bushnitzi says, we are so gonna butt frick some aliens. <laughs> Butters. <laughs> we sure, 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 maybe, I don't know. Maybe that's what we're doing, I don't know. <laughs> sure. <laughs> You, you got the spirit! They've got the spirit, folks! <laughs> Lightning reflexes! VPT Mayhem Ranger. Get him a scope. <laughs> Butt fricked and humbo built. Um, who's getting Okay, so you're gonna get Titan. And I might be shotgunning you, I think, was the plan. Big EC Titan, we love it. We love it. One of you doesn't get any armor at all, I have to remember. Uh, Symmetry can also frontline pretty nicely if I give him Titan, I think. There you go. Symmetry, bring more medkits, I guess. Yeah, it's Titan time, hell yeah. Titan A! Definitely get you some Titan. GMG for this map, I think, for you. You're the dank tank, you can bring a lot of dank. I hope you roll smoke and mirrors eventually, that'd be nice, but it's unlikely. Cool. Very tough. Slip up, slipper. I haven't heard that nickname before. That's a good one. Slip up, slipper. It's just kind of mean. Um, Rocketeer, get Titan. Slip up, slipper. Slipper, can we get a live slipper reaction? Are you here? Okay, we get two saviors, two smokes. So we got nothing yet. Uh, no, it's not done yet. Still like the Glup Slippo name. What, you mean when people just call them Shitto? That was... That was the foulest one for sure. I... I <laughs> it was in the middle of everyone making fun of Slippo. And someone just called him Shitto. And that one... I felt that one. That one was mean. That one was like too far. You can't just call him Shitto. <laughs> but I still think about it. So I guess you can. Uh, you're gonna need something as well. Wait, so who doesn't have armor here? Or did I get enough now for everyone? Aegis. You don't have armor, okay. Maybe... Slippo? No. Abu? No. Hmm. I guess it's you and Carapace, yeah. Just stay back, Slippo. And he says, Slipper failed to redeem himself on the trash mission. It's true, yeah, it's true. Can I have Titan off someone? Can someone give me some Titan? One, two, three, four. Maybe you give it up, Symmetry. You've got really good defense, so you take Aegis. 
give girl name Titan. Which is still really good, girl named. It's still really good. Girl named, I think you're gonna bring the smoke. I think you're gonna bring a lot of it. No respirator for you. Even more reason to give you Titan. Dense smoke, hit and run, hyper reactive smoke and mirrors. Yeah, probably just bring like. Maybe just bring nothing but it, actually. Just bring nothing but it. Nothing but the tooth. There you go. No respirator for you this time, girl. Why are you guys just saying took took in chat over and over? What is happening? I don't know this code. Would you like a helmet, Night Knave? Yeah, let's give you a cool little helmet. Meh. Newt Newt. I know Newt Newt. It's the past sense of TikTok. I love Kesha. I was talking about that the other day. I thought you guys were talking about Lord of the Rings or some shit, honestly. Okay, Titan. Titan. Maybe Aegis for you because of your mobility being trash shit. Maybe it has to be ages for you because of your mobility until the stutter gun. Like, you would have seven mobility? Yeah, we can't have that. The girls played Monster from a bit ago. They spent a few minutes doing just doing that. I still don't get it. I'm sorry. I don't get to be in on that joke. <laughs> I think Titan back for you, Symmetry. Titan. Lewis, you're gonna need some really cool helmet too, I think. Monster Home is a Jackbox party game? Okay. I don't play those because I don't have friends. There you go. Aegis and Aegis. Yeah, so you're wearing the carapace. You're gonna wear the Aegis. It's like Werewolf Mafia, but different of seeking victory points. It's com Starbright says it's competitive breeding. Okay, interesting. Good for you. Good for you. Um, okay. You're good to go. You're good to go. Monster Prom is a game where you try to woo a monster and go into promo view. Oh, cool. That sounds fun. Good for you and them, I guess. That sounds fun. Dead Eye. Okay. I guess this is the team. This looks alright, right? This looks pretty good. <laughs> Zabushuji says, do you perhaps freak the monsters? <laughs> Who knows, honestly. Who knows? Not just anyone, so your friend was a monster in disguise. Oh! I see. Do you want to be a major night knave? Is that even on the table? You've been on a few missions, it should be. Yeah, here you go. Uh, yeah, let's level up. All soldiers, more XP, let's do it. Reasonable says the casual trad GF versus the competitive monster fucker. And they're very brave, our monster fuckers, to be clear. They're very brave. Society depends on them. We love our monster fuckers, folks. A round of applause for them, please, if you don't just take a second. They're very brave. And we do depend on them. Thank you to all the monster fuckers. Thank you very much. Oh no, I played on my buttons once again. No! No!
I think we're ready to go. Sometimes a man just wants to hit Mr. Worldwide on his soundboard and have it go off at the same time. A man can't have it all, though. A man can't have it all. Got a lot of smoke, got battle scanners, got smokes, got a lot of long guns. Even got mayhem on Night Knave. It's a lot of damage on this party. Some line holders. Last thing I've got to do, which I almost forgot, is raffle. Let's find out who's going on the mission. Mr. Worldwide! Jesus. Okay, draw. The first winner is Umbriel149. Congratulations to you. Mr. Worldwide! And the second winner is. Mr. Worldwide! No, it's. Mr. Worldwide! No, it's. Mr. Worldwide! No, it's. Hey, Commander! No, it's Roger Wilco. Umbriel 149 and Roger Wilco, you have both won. Congratulations. <laughs> Mr. Worldwide scared my cat. Your cat doesn't like that? Why did Oh, because he's a dog, because he's Pitbull. I get it. Roger Wilco. What? <laughs> Sorry, my fingers were in the wrong spot. <laughs> Okay, Ro Roger Wilco, folks. That's their name, and they're ready for action. <laughs> Reger. Everybody's geared up. Let's go on a mission. Touching down. We're heading into China for the next operation. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. We're still picking up transmissions oh, indicating alien movement in one of their major city centers. We should get down there and secure the area ASAP. <laughs>